this. <coughs> Partner, that hurt. <coughs> that hurted. <coughs> um, but yeah, you guys, I... Honestly, to be honest, really was trying to hurry up and take a hit and record it for you while Thank You Next was on. Because that was a vibe. But that did not happen. So, yeah, my, um, my music stopped for a minute. And that is unfortunate, but it's all good it's weird how like on my laptop now like things for fucked up feet by the way it's my foot update or like popping up now like this bitch is listening to me and like things for cbd that's weird oh warning mm -hmm. alert virus alert yeah no shit bitch anyways I can't breathe, bitch. Because I took a good ass hit. I need to buy a new pen soon. This one went awfully fast, but it's because I've been smoking it awfully fast. Ow, why does my nose hurt? I swear someone's doing brujaria on me. That burned my mouth. <coughs> Back at it again. <coughs> I wish I knew the rest of the lyrics, so I'd... <coughs> so. <coughs> oh my gosh. That hurts. Can you make my pillows look kind of cuter? Oh my gosh, I'm back at it again. Should I do light? Or should I do dark? I'll do dark. <coughs> Why did I put the cherries upside down? This is the real freaking. <coughs> <coughs> oh, Lord. <coughs> My bed. <coughs> Man. <coughs> Not hit. <coughs> really hit. <coughs> I tried doing that whole thing where they press it down until it starts blinking it did not start blinking um or maybe it did but i couldn't tell through the ring light it like made it too bright and i couldn't see but yeah my bed frame is here it's outside it's in the front it's too heavy for me to bring inside but i'm excited about that so i'm gonna do some makeup and if you guys know how to upload pictures into a flash drive, please let me know. Or into my laptop from my phone and videos because I don't know how to do that. Air my God, I'm back at it again. So I've decided I was gonna I was thinking about Am I going to do my hair parted down the middle? Let me, I should change my shirt so you can get a better perspective of how old my hair is. I was thinking, should I do my ha my hair parted down the middle? And uh, just straight? Like, just straight, straight? Um, or should I do it parted to the side and just straight and do that like you know look it'll look better with my makeup on i promise or should i go to my favorite hair look right now which i think i'm gonna do so no questions about it okay that's my favorite hair look right now it matches my bitmoji perfectly and mia 
Fam or something like that on YouTube. You should watch her. She's an Asian girl. She's really cool. She recently went to go visit Adeline Morin or whatever. And yeah, I just saw she got extensions in her hair, dyed her hair black. She had that red streak going on um, in the front of her hair. It's a highlight. It was like a one high, one red streak going on one side of her. I don't know. But yeah, I washed my hair twice in a row. Because I've been wearing hairspray lately and I just felt like I had to get that shit out of my hair, you know? And since my new mattress and bed came in, I'm going to go get my new bed sheets today. I just want to be like extra squeaky clean, you know what I'm saying? Oh my god, I am back at it again. Gotta, gotta, gotta. Brayden. Do you guys watch Adeline? What do you guys watch? Like, what YouTubers do you guys watch? Do you have any recommendations? Do we have things in common as to what... Ow! I burned myself! As to what we watch. Have you guys watched any of the things that I have suggested? I haven't been watching um, Silence Tippy very much for some reason. Or Koala Puffs for some reason. They were my shit when I was living by myself. In my apartment, but now I'm watching more of like Adeline, more of like, uh, I just actually got into Alicia Marie again. I was never really into her actually, but I knew of her because I was into her friends. Oh my god, Justin, stop calling me. It's my day off. I'm trying to film. Like, why are you being so annoying? Because he does not watch my videos. Like, he's being extra annoying today. But, like, it's my day off. I'm trying. Like, he wakes me up at 7 in the morning this morning or 8 to wake me up. And I'm like, why are you waking me up this early? You always wake me up early. Hold on. Let me text him back. Not in my way. And so, like, I don't know. Like, I'm just. He's so annoying. Things like this annoy me about him. Like, I'm just trying to relax, film on my only day off, and you want to be an annoying person about it. And then he was like, riddle me this, bitch. He texted me that. Like, dude, you have no respect for me at all if you're going to still be calling me a bitch and be, like, disrespectful and stuff. Just because I posted a picture on Facebook story saying... And I guess because I was in shorts or something. And he was like, I put update. My foot still really hurts. And he texts me back, little me this bitch. How do you have not have time to talk to me? Because I'm filming and I was like straightening my hair and jamming the music. So like I didn't want to be on the phone. And um and not, and but you have time to be posting that shit on, on your story. And um you don't have time to talk to the person that actually cares about you. Like, first of all. Um, I have all my family on Facebook, which is why I have Facebook, so they care about me way more than you do, and they're worried about my foot, and, like, you're mad, like, I don't even know why you're mad, I don't know, stuff like that, like, he needs to chill out, because that's shit I do not fuck with, and it stresses me out, and, like, I'm even wasting my breath talking about it right now. <clears throat> So he better take a chill pill. But yeah. So anyway. <coughs> anyways, the plans for today were to... I had a lot of plans for today. I had a whole to-do list. But my stepdad ended up needing to buy my car because he's a cop. So he cannot drive his patrol unit around town if it's not for work-related things so yeah he had to take my grandma to the doctor my step-grandma or whatever so yeah he took off so all my plans <clears throat> were kind of canceled until later i have to go to jc penny still i have to go get some anti-inflammatory or whatever the fuck it's called that anti-x anti something i don't know it sounds like xanax but it's for anti-inflammatory it's an anti-inflammatory or whatever Oh my god, I'm back at it again. Guys, I haven't smoked a blunt in so long. I need to hit up my cousin or my brother.
I've only been smoking vape spots, which is good for me because I cannot, like I said, my cigarette is hot, and I cannot smoke the ganja in the house because I used to get in trouble for that a lot when I was younger before the whole wax pens were invented and stuff. <clears throat> And the closest we thought to, like, the future, like, the, if you've seen Pineapple Express, you know, when they're doing the cross joint, and he's like, that future, that future, that's what your grandkids are going to be smoking, man. Like, did you ever <clears throat> even imagine it was going to be, like, wax pens? Not me. Not me either. Imagine they really are really bad for you, and, like, Trump invented them. Wow, what a theory, huh? Wow, my hair feels so healthy. <clears throat> I, I'm starting, sometimes when I switch up shampoos, like the shampoo that didn't work for me previously, like years previously, works for me again, just cause like I haven't used it in a while. And after the ones that, start, the new ones that I start finding, like the hemp ones and stuff, they stop working as well for me. But yeah, this one, it's the big bottle of the white Tresemme conditioner that's really been helping me and the navy blue dove shampoo. And I've been putting the mint uh, head and shoulders on my scalp because I got dandruff and I like the way that mint makes my scalp feel. <laughs> but also what I need to order on Amazon today, I guess since I don't have the car, I can do that, <coughs> is an exfoliating love for my hand I'm gonna use that in the shower instead of a loofah just because I could wash those in the washing machine and wash it out and not have to buy more loofahs and stuff like that I was watching this video I forget her name let me look her up give me a sec because she has this oh what a verga I dropped my water bottle but it was closed thank god and empty <clears throat> but um yeah she's freaking cool she's a weetuber but she doesn't do any weed things on youtube she does like cool cool videos though on youtube so she does like recipes she does clothing hauls clean up closets or whatever um lots of different videos she lives on a farm in oregon so that's pretty much self-explanatory she's badass OMG, I'm back at it again. Go do my pen. Mayday, mayday, where's the pen? Found it. I like to have my pen sitting up like that just because it's here, Marie. Just because. Did you guys watch the Vanessa Bryan speaks about the celebration of the life of Kobe and her their daughter? Oh, you guys, I was balling. Pun not intended, but it worked out. They balling now in heaven. And it's crazy how, like, everything that she said um, from the, like, the end part and everything where she was like, I'm at peace, like, God wouldn't have taken them if they weren't if they didn't go together like you know and I when when everything that happened and I found out like she was in the helicopter with him and all that stuff and how close they were I was like dude like I, w I was just praying to God for their you know t for their crossover like their crossing to be peaceful and stuff I, I hope that everybody just let them rest in peace since a lot of people are talking about it you know I just was hoping like let them rest in peace let their family just come to grips with everything. Not come to grips because I know they will never come to grips. I'm not saying that disrespectfully. I'm just saying, like, she had the perspective that I prayed to God for. Like, please, like, I like I think they, you know, went together. You know, they knew that they're going to be okay. And I just hope that their mom, like, oh, I'm going to start praying again. And luckily, like, you just have to watch the interview and you'll get what I'm saying. Like, she, she did feel or express that she felt the same way that I prayed that she would feel mentally. I mean, not I, I can, I mean, 
I've never lost a daughter, but I have lost my father. And yeah, so. Do, 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 do. What was I going to look up? My subscriptions. What video was I looking for? I know exactly what video I was looking for, actually. OMG, I'm back at it again. Ah, I, it's because I don't, I've never really used this on my laptop, so I'm just starting to learn. I hope I like the video. I'm, I know I did. I know I did it. I, I liked all my videos, but hers is here. OMG, I'm back. I'm going to feel so dumb when I find her name and then what the fudge is it? Oh, it's because I'm in history. Mm, I don't know how to work this, so I apologize. So we'll take me back. Megan Kloska. Oh, here she is. I'm so stupid. Megan Hops. <coughs> I apologize if I'm completely butchering your name, but this is her. And <coughs> <coughs> the video is called 30 Things I Don't Buy or Own. You guys should seriously check it out. And then um, Baking a Treat Before Period Week. I haven't watched that video yet, but that was the previous video before the one I just told you to watch, the 30 things I don't own, and that one looks good. But yeah, she does like a closet, closet purges and all this shit. Um, yeah, she does a lot of cool stuff. I love her, and Finley, shout out to you guys for your inspo and tips. And yeah, I'm about to watch the YouTube or er, House to War by Mac Dizzle for 20. I believe it's Mac Dizzle for 20. Yep. And I am Cord M. Adri slash. Barry with three Y's for Twente. Don't forget it, y'all. Don't forget it. Don't forget it. So I haven't had coffee today. I didn't go to Lent. I can't decide what to get up, give up for Lent just because I have given up a few things recently. So. And I'm not Catholic, so I don't know. You have to be Catholic to do all that. TBH, but yeah, I'm just OMG, I'm back at it again. Don't feel like doing my motherfucking makeup once again. I feel like jamming out, but this laptop does not have a speaker. So that sucks. I have to use headphones for it, which I do not have headphones with an cord. What's wrong with me? But guys, I, I've posted lots of videos lately, so I hope you like them. I got eight views, one view. Yay! That I posted 10 hours ago. That's pretty good. That is that. Um, bedroom makeover haul. I got eight views, smoke sesh, 20 views. Wow. And that's the one that I thought was going to do bad because I look so ugly. <laughs> so that's, yeah, that's another thing. And then I got another get ready with me for work. I thought that one was going to do well. I only got 10 views. 
So you see, it's always the ones that I least expect. Studio. OMG, I'm back at it again. And then my old, which I forgot. The, uh, <clears throat> I forgot the password to this one. But yeah, it's called Adri No Slash Fairy with three Y's. So it's Adri Space Fairy with one Y. I'm sorry. That was my old channel. This one, I got a lot of, this is my most hated video, you guys. Me, Justin, and our friend Jules went to go eat at this Mexican restaurant. It has 57.174, I don't know. Can you see how many views it has? Right here. That's a lot of views. But yeah, we're just like hitting dabs in a restaurant, you see? And, like, the people got so mad. Like, look. I had 70 subscribers, which is more than I got now. But I'm almost to 50, you guys. So, we're almost there. We're almost at our goal. I hope to have 50 by tomorrow. That was my goal. But, whatever. At least by my birthday, March 12th. Um, but, yeah, you look like a subway rat, someone says. She high as hell. Were they talking about me or Justin looking like a subway rat? I'm just kidding. Um, you need chapstick. Wow, what a bitch. 90 people liked that. 91 people liked that. And then uh, Cash Cardi. She high as hell. 101 people liked that. 69 people liked the one that says you look like a subway rat. Oh, that's fucked up. This one has a lot to it's October first, thousand seventeen. Vlog smithish. I mean Vlogtober plus DIY ideas. So that was maybe a good um title. You think that's why more people watched that? I don't know. It was way worse quality. Way worse, but F it. And my comments for that are turned off, thank God, because I feel embarrassed by these ones. Okay. I want to get to the other ones. OMG, I'm back at it again. I guess this will be like my first um, reading my hate comments video. Because, yeah, the comments here are pretty hateful on this video. But, F it. There's 62 comments, you guys. Like, I never get comments on my videos that I post on this channel. Um... She tripping, trying to open her eyes when they're already open, lol. Bitch, I was opening my eyes because I was shook that Justin was hitting that pen so hard. And there was a man sitting behind him. And then, yeah, that one got 75 likes. Ah, think ahead says, crusty lips, bitch. Okay. Sometimes I don't like to drink water. And it's a nicotine. I'm weak. Oh, yeah, because I said it's nicotine. <laughs> they put it's nicotine in the quotations. They put I'm weak. No mommy's way. Someone says Cobra E says no man. No mommy's way. Mariah Cheyenne. Oh, I like that name. Maybe I'll name my daughter that. Shy, S H Y A N N E. Wow, it kind of rhymes with Adrienne. And Cheyenne is like a George Strait song. And it's like, it has a lot of meaning to me and my mom. So that's cute. Uh, but yeah, go follow her, you guys. Tell me what happened. I don't know. It keeps switching video. Okay. And then, Poyo Dank as fuck. Respect, bro. We should all smoke. Hey, that one got four likes. She said, wait, can you see the eyes and the mouth that that one put? She said, that's the face I made. 
Yeah, when I try to open my eyes when Justin took that big ass hit. I hear vines wins net letters next than Nandos. I guess that's a artist that was playing in the back of the Mexican restaurant. You need some Carmex. Damn, why are y'all hating? Damn, you crazy. You need some Carmex to have three likes. Wow, you a bitch. Uh, what a bunch of head, head heat ups. What does that mean? What a bunch of heat ups? Like so much? I subbed. Oh, thank you, dude. Prestige games. Thanks. Free Smokey bought sub says laugh my ass off. She stuck. <laughs> um, she stuck. What she got in her lip? <laughs> I get it. My lip, my lips weren't even that crusty in this video. Uh, wax pen hit tell. Hits in Alaska. Wax pen hits Alaska. Whatever that means. Oh, I guess she's getting she's smoking all wax pens from Alaska. That's lit, dude. Why the fuck does it keep doing that? It keeps switching over the video. Um, let's go back. Uh, someone says, LOL, so one person like that, why, Waxman Kids in Alaska from P. Ocean, I like your name, go follow him, uh, yeah, I, people still watch this channel, actually, wow, this was only 10 years ago, and this was like two years ago, these videos, uh, I think they, uh, Don, Don Ray, yeah, we were, hi guys, go follow my new channel, Bitch, that was me commenting and doing a post on your channel. Justin, Shilly got done something. You're gorgeous. Thank you, man. Appreciate that. Is that in H Town? Yes, it is. Seven replies. Let's see what they say. So, Houston, okay, Houston rules. William Holmes, if you get caught with dab cart in Texas, it's on valid felony. Possession of Schedule 1 controlled substance, blah, blah, blah. Yes, we get it, bro. We live life on the edge over here. Okay. Kobe. But at least you can carry if you have, like, less than... You have to you have to Google it. But if you have less than, like, a nick on you, um, I think you just get... Ouch. You just get a ticket. You don't get a... You don't get arrested or anything anymore in Houston. But you have to Google that. So Houston, William Holmes, if you get, yeah, 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 we get it, homie. Once again, it's like my lips aren't even that chapped in this video, bro. Oh, I get why it's changing now. Am I almost done with these freaking pot? Let's just go all the way down to the bottom and then start again, I guess. This was fun. Reading these little topics. But yeah, you guys, go subscribe to this channel too. Damn, how far did it go? Okay, here, let's see. It's this way. Wait, okay, it's this delight. It's desk delight, not wax. Someone says, You're cool. Y'all are gone. Burnout. Distance. Oh, yeah, disgrace to the race. That's the one that I wanted to show you guys. Someone said that I was a disgrace to my race. And then another one that says, Come hit my pen. I bet you got. Handle this wax. Okay, not that far. Okay. I comment on this video with no opinion. Well, thanks for the comment. Um, it's not in H Town. Yes, it is. You're gorgeous. Okay, someone had said that 
I can't find the exact comment, but someone, it might be a new, a new surprise. In Houston, I've been in, into that restaurant. It's called Don Ray. Okay, we get it. Omar HX is, I call bullshit. Kobe, look up the restaurant. The fuck? Why I got a life for it? Yeah, it's in Houston. I smoke weed everywhere in Houston, bro. I used to hit my dad pen in school, too. Yeah, like, bro, you just being a fucking hater. Anyway, but yeah, there was someone who said that I make stoners look bad and shit. That I was a dis- There was another- One person that said I was a disgrace to the race and that- And then there was another person, I guess they deleted their comment because they got a lot of hate for it. Because they were like, you make stoners look bad. Like, this is why you make it look like, bitch, what? You make stoners look bad for bitching and being a pussy. Like, we smoke weed everywhere, especially in H-Town, bro. Like, what the fuck? But yeah, we get it. It's legal. Stoners get everywhere.